The next question says, an air bubble in a glass sphere having 4 cm diameter appears 1 cm from the surface nearest to I when looked along diameter. If mu is 1.5, the distance of bubble from refracting surface is. Now I can assume this to be the glass sphere. This is the axis along which the observer is, wa observer is watching through. And let's say this is where the air bubble is placed. Now from the diagram, it appears that the U must be negative. But since we are supposed to find the value of U, we will not assume its sign convention. I repeat, the one which is unknown, should not we should not assume its sign convention. So we can say the V, velocity, or actually the distance of the image is at minus one centimeter because they say the image appears inside the glass sphere so it is on the left hand side of this optical center and the radius of curvature is going to be minus two centimeter because this is the curvature on which you can say the refraction is taking place and the diameter is given as four centimeter so radius is half of that we can say mu1 is the refractive index where the object is placed. So that is 1.5 because it's inside the glass sphere. Mu2 is the second surface which uh, happens to be found after the refraction is taking place. So after the refraction, the light must go in the air. So mu2 must be 1. Now using the formula of refraction at single curved surface, we get mu2 minus mu1 by r as mu2 by v minus mu1 by u. Now, if we substitute the values, so we get 1 minus 1.5 upon negative 2 is equal to 1 upon minus 1 minus 1.5 upon u. Now, if I rearrange this equation, I get 1.5 by u as minus 1 minus 1 minus 1.5 is 0.5, negative 0.5, the negative sign gets cancelled, 1.5 by 2 is 1 by 4 with a positive sign going over there becomes negative 1 by 4. Now calculating this we get this as minus 5 by 4. So now if I rearrange this equation I get u as 4 into 1.5 which is 6 with a negative sign upon 5 and therefore u is minus 1.2 and that is the final answer.